Hello, I'm Tim, the Woodworking Maniac, and today I wanted to give you all a bit of an update of what's been going on in my shop. Well, I have actually been super, super busy in my shop because I've been uh, preparing for quite a few different craft shows that I've got coming up here in the next few weeks. Uh, November and December are uh, quite often uh, busy times for me for doing uh, different uh, craft shows for the holidays. And matter of fact, uh, right after Thanksgiving, uh, matter of fact, starting on Black Friday, this is actually the first time I'm doing a craft show that actually starts on Black Friday, but I've got a three-day craft show that actually starts this Friday. Uh, and it's uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, uh, all-day all events. Uh, so I've got a busy weekend coming up uh, right after the holidays, which I'm not necessarily looking forward to, but, you know, it is what it is, and it's coming right up. But... Um, I haven't had a whole lot of time to actually do any sort of video or anything with that. Uh, so for that, I do apologize. But uh, I did want to give you guys a bit of an update and also wish you all a very, very happy Thanksgiving. Uh, I know today we're going to be uh, visiting with a lot of family and everything else. Uh, I'm actually recording this the night before, uh, so I can actually post this uh, uh, in the morning on Thanksgiving. I'm actually... Uh, uh, going to be traveling uh, and visiting some family myself. So uh, I wish everybody safe travels and a great Thanksgiving day with their families. And I hope everybody has an awesome day. <clears throat> so uh, one thing that I really wanted to uh, point out to everybody is uh, that I have the giveaway going this month. And a lot of people have already signed up, but I wanted to just give everybody a good reminder that the giveaway is still going on and it goes on to the end of the month and uh, there's only a few days left. So get on my website, sign up, and uh, there's five different uh, tool packages available for you all to, to win. $665 worth of tools. So really awesome packages by Craig, FastCap, and Rockler. Uh, some really awesome stuff on there and like I said, a few days left, left to sign up. On December 1st is when I will be announcing those winners. And if you notice, my sticker uh, cabinet door back here is a lot more full than what it used to be. I finally had an opportunity to take all of those stickers that everybody had been sending me and also the stickers that I acquired while I was over at uh, Woodworking America and put them on the door. So you can stay, see up here, I'm actually going to uh, show you all, all the individual stickers that I've been adding up here. I uh, wish I can actually show you them individually and announce all the names, but there are too many to, to announce in this video and make a very long video for, it, for me. But over at WIA, uh, it was really, really awesome meeting so many people. It was really a great experience. Uh, I got to meet a bunch of other creators over there, and uh, that was really awesome. A lot of them, it was just like I already knew them. I mean, I've spoken with them so many different times online in different ways. Uh, it was like uh, going and finally just hanging out with them. But uh, it was still really awesome, awesome just meeting them in person and things like that. But also what was really awesome was meeting you guys, uh, a lot of the viewers that are out there. Uh, a lot of you guys came up and introduced yourselves and uh, thanked me for doing some videos and things like that. That was just uh, heartwarming. I mean, it was it was humbling and everything else. It was just really, really awesome. And and thank you for that. Uh, I was the it was the greatest thing. It was just really awesome. Uh, I'm definitely looking forward to the next event that we're going to be having and uh, getting together like that. I know uh, a lot of the creators are going to be getting together in uh, April as well. So look forward to that. Um, I uh, also wanted to let you all know that uh, I uh, have, uh, I ever now and then post a few different things on other social medias. Uh, you can also, you can follow me on Twitter and I guess uh, other feeds and stuff end up posting me on, posting on Twitter. Uh, I guess I don't interact too much on Twitter, but uh, every now and then I, I do uh, interact a little bit. I'm, I'm just not all that fluent with it. Uh, but Instagram is definitely one way to kind of follow me. I've been uh, really trying to, trying to integrate a little bit more into that. Uh, so anytime that I'm working in the shop and I find something that interesting that I'm working with or something like that, I'll end up posting uh, an image on Instagram or maybe do a short video clip or something like that, and I'll post on Instagram. So if you're not following me on Instagram, uh, look me up. Uh, definitely follow me on Instagram. Uh, earlier today, 
I ended up uh, making something on Instagram, or well, didn't make it on Instagram, but I ended up making it here in the shop, and I, I thought it came out really, really cool. So I ended up posting it on Instagram. What it was, I uh, pulled some lumber off the off the rack here, and I actually started with just some plain old maple. At least that's what I thought, because uh, it's all rough, rough cut maple. So I was just using some plain maple, and I was going to make a, uh, a guitar shaped cutting board. Well, when I started joining it, it turned out to be really curly maple. So I little extra bonus. I don't know if the curl will actually show in this video here, but uh, this ended up looking really, really awesome. So uh, I ended up doing a guitar shaped uh, cutting board. It's about an inch and three quarter thick and it's got a uh, inch and a quarter deep pocket here uh, that's actually nice uh, rounded on the inside here. It's got a, a 3 8 inch uh, round uh, pocket here. Or well, it's a 3 8 inch uh, kind of a, a round divot on the, on the inside here. So it's, it's not a sharp, sharp edge when you're in here because uh, that would actually be really hard to clean out. Um, but basically anytime that you're cutting something here, you can either put your scraps in, inside here so you can dump later or you can have uh, uh, anything that you're cutting up. If you're dicing up, you have a place to kind of put all the dice pieces in into. So that was just something I was making and I thought it looked cool. So I ended up posting it on Instagram. So I ended up, I, every now and then I, I post some interesting things on Instagram. I also ended up making one out of walnut, uh, which kind of disappears in my shirt, but I uh, made one out of walnut as well. So I thought those came out pretty neat. Uh, to talk about the, uh, the sticker thing, uh, sorry, I got a little sidetracked. Uh, about the sticker thing, I ended up getting one letter, uh, uh, one sticker in the mail from Bob Blanford. He's uh, RJB Woodturner. He's another YouTube uh, creator. And the sticker came in uh, this envelope that uh, it looked like it got eaten up uh, through the U.S. Postal Service. And if you notice, the, uh, the letter that he also sent me, he sent me a nice letter. Um, at least for what I could read, uh, seemed really nice. I, I only got about half the message that he wrote me. Um, but it, it seemed really nice of what, what he said. Uh, so Bob, I appreciate the message. And, uh, it only got part of the sticker that it actually e ate up. Uh, but it actually ended up working out just fine. It didn't mess up his logo at all. So I actually contacted him. I ended up sending him a message and saying, hey, uh, you're, you're, envelope got got messed up in the mail and he said hey i'll send you another sticker i was like no 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 no, your logo is just fine and it works out just it, it's okay it'll just give me something to talk about and uh it, your logo didn't get messed up so it, it's fine uh, and uh the sticker actually it, it worked out pretty good because it made, made the sticker fit a little bit better on on my uh, uh sticker cabinet here so uh that that worked out just fine so bob thanks for the letter and uh uh <laughs> interesting story so, like I was saying uh, before, uh, I didn't get a whole lot of uh, videos uh, out here in the past uh, couple weeks because I've been super busy in the shop, but I've got a lot of really cool stuff coming out here in the near future. Uh, I've got a few new tools in the shop that uh, you're going to be really interested in. Uh, some of my Instagram followers may have noticed that I've got a new shop bot in here. Uh, so I've got a new CNC that I'm going to be comparing in with the X-Carve. So I've got two CNCs in the shop that I'm going to do, be doing a couple comparisons on. So that'll be just a couple videos that'll uh, uh, showcase uh, uh, what the differences are there. Uh, so you can kind of see where where your money lies on uh, on different options there if you're actually interested in those things. So there's, there's going to be that. And then there's also going to be a few different other things that I'm going to be doing uh, here in the near future. So definitely uh, keep keep an eye out for... A lot of lot of new stuff coming out and I still have a whole lot more shop projects I've got to do because I'm still working on organizing the shop but uh, once I get the shop organized you are gonna uh, be blown away with the difference in the uh, in the sh way the shop is done if you haven't seen my previous shop tour definitely check out the previous shop tour because the new shop tour that's gonna be coming out here in the next couple months is night and day difference so I'll be doing a new shop tour probably in the next couple months and it's it doesn't even look like it's the same shop. Uh, you probably won't even believe it's in the same, same space. But I want to thank you guys for watching the video and thank you guys for just following me in general.
And like I said before, I wish you guys safe travels, safe uh, week, and I hope you all have a great day with your families. And happy Thanksgiving, and God bless.